All right, coming up next, it is a women's strawweight championship fight between Kylan Curran and Claudia Gedalia. Fair here, she is the number one strawweight contender. This is a five-tool player, ladies and gentlemen. One of the best 115-pound fighters we've ever seen. A fighter that many fans believe already is the number one fighter in this division. Now, though, her chance to prove it, to get the hardware, to get the gold, and attach UFC strawweight champion to her name in perpetuity. As she makes her way to the octagon right now, her preparation has been perfect. She is in fantastic shape, she is focused, she is motivated, and she believes she will leave this cage tonight as the new champion of the world. So much depth now at 115 pounds, but they're all still chasing her. Yeah, they are, the undisputed UFC strawweight champion. And she's got the confidence that belies the champion. As you see her make this walk here tonight, she won the belt with flying colors, defended it with style points, and that's the same goal here tonight. She really is a fighter that maintains a calm demeanor, takes it fight by fight. She has aspirations to be the greatest of all time. She is well on her way. The champion is making her way to the cage right now. Her preparation for this title bout has been absolutely according to plan. She is focused, she is in great shape, motivated and determined to step in here and put on a championship level performance and retain her title. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC strawweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding professional record of 15 wins, three losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Introducing the challenger, Claudia Gadel. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, holding professional record of four wins, six losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting at an Eva Beach, Hawaii, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC strongly champion of the world, Kylan Cole. for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go down right now. Curran gets caught with that punch. Got to show up the defense. Nice straight left and a right hand behind it. Oh! Showing that punch. So she's holding on to her here, not doing too much, really oh, just big elbow. Oh, huge elbow. Oh, very nice. Oh, and there's the spinning back fist, Joe. Big straight punch. Huge shots there. Oh, big left. Beautiful hook. Back and forth we go. <laughs> Powerful oh, uppercut up over there. Body kick, look at that. Nasty combinations here. Huge kicks. Another kick to the body by Kylan Curran. Oh, the clinch battle continues. Now she's got over under. 
pummeling under. She moves to the back now. Oh, good work with the knees here by Gedalia. Take down lands for her. Changes her stance yet again. Oh, how good is her jab, Joe? Well, she almost moved right into harm's way there as the body strike lands. Can't leave your body that wide open if you want to stay in this fight. Oh, this could be it right here. Hard straight punch. Gedalia better move. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Under two minutes to go. And she hits the hips. Nice judo throw. Oh, man, I love it. She's looking to set up an arm bar. She's got that arm bar locked up. That was a deep arm bar, but a beautiful escape. Ooh, postures up and now goes with a big strike to the body. Well done there by Kylan Cook. The spinning back fist lands. Good shots by the champion. How about that shin? She's starting to put together some significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this shot fight goes up. Uppercut that got the job done. Yeah, Joe, that was just a near perfect strike to end the fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming. And this is exactly the way she drew it up. She said, I need to win this fight, but I need to do it by stoppage. I can't leave it in the judges' hands. If I'm going to take my career to the next level, I've got to get the knockout win here tonight. Mission accomplished. Here it is one more time. Boom! Perfectly placed uppercut. And ladies and gentlemen, there she is, the UFC Women's Strawweight Champion. The celebration is on after the knockout win under the bright lights tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us off for this contest at four minutes, 21 seconds of the very first round. We're playing the winner by knockout and still. Well, she came in as the undisputed queen of the 115 pounders, and Joe, that is exactly the way she goes out. There she is, and still UFC Women's Strawweight Champion, and what a way to get the job done tonight. She gets the flush KO, and that is one celebration going on in that corner right now. An amazing moment and result for the undisputed best at 115 pounds.